Like, what exactly does a city manager do? And what we do is we do 380 different things, including education, uh, team building, and also games using virtual reality. We teach everything um, in cosmetology as far as hair care, hair cutting, coloring, uh, braiding, and styling. We are an automation company that will build machines that kind of help processes go by faster. But we have a license to sell all of John Deere products, all of their agricultural equipment and all of their lawn and garden equipment. We brought a lot of our model shop works, which do a lot of work with the 3D printings. We brought one of our robotic arms so that the students can see how um, Robotics is working into our, our worlds of um, engineering as well. We've been meeting with students today and trying to uh, let them know about different career pathways in the visual and performing arts. I work in the field of cybersecurity. If you're not familiar with cybersecurity, think of it kind of like as a security guard for a building, but I'm protecting computers and networks and information. Here promoting um, outdoor education, environmental education, and just the parks department. We teach skin care, facials, waxing, makeup. Today I'm here to talk to kids about a future in aviation because you can either work for a living or you can fly. Today we are showcasing some of the basic skills that the students learn in class. Um, airway management, backboarding, bandaging skills, how the monitor works. We're here today with our virtual welder a video display and some other displays of what we do. Really what you need to take away is that we have two tracks. There's networking and there's app dev, so there's hardware and then there's programming stuff. We're designing for the health and the wellness of communities, um, small scale to large scale. Uh, we spend 90% of our time indoors, so architecture has a big role to play. On um, different uh, uh, equipment, needles, and like I said, just how it's evolved. The image on the screen, this is a kidney and the blood flow into the kidney. We're not just a broadcasting company, we do a lot of different things with advertising and how we're involved in the community. We teach nails, nail care, manicures, and pedicures. I'll put them on this machine to kind of get them familiar with the basics of welding, the different travel angles, work speed, that sort of thing. So behind me we have a demonstration robot that shows several different processes that we would put in our larger machines. And really the best way to describe it is I, I point to some of the uh, folks around me and I say, well, I don't fight fires like the firefighters, which allows us to use as a training aid and it lets us, you know, fight fire without actually having to go into a burning builder and fight fire. I don't stop crime like the police department. I don't fix roads. I don't pick up leaves. By profession, I'm a medical lab scientist. So I didn't want to be a doctor or a nurse when I was growing up, but I loved medicine. We also have business classes to help you set up your business and uh, take care of your, your taxes and receipts and things like that. This is about six years. We started off as a small business in our house and just merged into being a bigger business over time. That just tested their coordination and balance and flexibility and it's a key part of what physical therapists do. They get people um, back to health. And they work hand in hand with that automation division to make sure that we are sending the best part to our customers. But I work with all those departments and I make sure they have the tools and the knowledge and the expertise to do their jobs. Anything else? What was I told you? See, I already forgot. <laughs>